Welcome! In front of me I have Fitbit Versa 4 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on this watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications uh, from your phone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your phone via the Fitbit application. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we can open the Fitbit application on the phone that is paired uh, with our watch. So let's open the Fitbit application. In the app, you should see the Today page. Now tap on the profile icon right here in the top left corner to open the account page. And here you should see your Versa 4 on the list of devices connected to your account. Tap on this Versa 4 device to select it. And here on this page, scroll down find the notifications option and tap on it. If you don't have the required permissions allowed for the notifications to work, you probably will see this message. Tap on enable notification service. It will redirect you to the settings. In settings, you will see list of applications and on this list, you will see Fitbit application. And if it says not allowed under the Fitbit application, you need to tap on it, tap on the switch, tap on allow, and once you allow the notification access, you probably will be asked to allow more permissions like call logs, SMS, and stuff like that. So allow the permissions. And once you allow the permissions, you will be able to enable or disable the notifications. For example, we can enable or disable the notifications for calls. We can tap on text messages. Here we can enable or disable the notifications. And also we can select the default message messaging app. We can use WhatsApp or messages. Next, we have the calendar events. You can tap on it and you can enable or disable the notifications and also select the default app. Then we have emails. Same, we can enable or disable the notifications and select the default email app. And the app notifications, if you tap right here, uh, you can basically enable and disable the notifications for specific applications. So basically how it works is if you enable the notification for, for the app, uh, and the notification appears on your phone from that specific app, it will be forwarded to your watch. If it's disabled, it won't be forwarded to your watch. Basically, you won't receive the notification from that app on the watch. So if you want to uh, get the notifications from the apps on your watch, you need to enable uh, the notifications for them right here. Okay, I'm gonna find Discord and enable it. And once you're done, you can go back. Um, next option we have reply settings and we can enable or disable the voice replies and you can also uh, tap on quick replies and here you can uh, set the default replies you can tap on default replies and fill them in or you can set the replies for specific apps you can set basically select for example discord and fill them in right here and uh, the replies for specific apps will override the default ones so that's how it works. Okay. Uh, next we have vibration settings and we can enable option to always vibrate even though do not disturb mode is enabled. And in advanced settings, you can enable the transl transliteration if you want to. Okay, and once you're done customizing the settings for your notifications, you should be able to receive them. You can also test it by pressing on the more options button right here and tapping on set a test call notification tap on okay okay apparently because i have a silent mode enabled on my phone it won't work so let me actually disable the silent mode like this and now it should work as you can see it's working we have the incoming test call and we can for example reject it okay i'm gonna also send myself a message on discord that just to check or show that it works so let me open discord As you can see, we got the notification on our phone and also on our watch. Okay, and you can mark it as red, you can reply, you can open, you can clear it. And if you miss the notifications, you can swipe upwards from the uh, bottom of the screen to open the notification panel. Okay, and that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please 
uh, consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video. Thank you.